Right, well, my name is Kral Dasher. I'm a senior lecturer at the Department of Environmental Management at Lincoln University. And what I teach is geographic information systems. So I deal a lot with spatial data and GIS and how we use technology and uh, to simulate real world problems. And one in particular that I've been working with for the past couple of months is with Lake Forsyth, Wairewa, which is out towards Little River on Banks Peninsula. And in this particular case, we have the council, we have the local runanga. They're really interested in trying to work with the lake to maintain a permanent opening. So it's always open to the sea. So you get flushings of water in and out with the tides. And some of the big questions they have are, what are the kinds of flows and what are the structures that we might need to be able to maintain a permanent opening? And that's where GIS comes in and that's where the physical modeling comes in. So what we're able to do with GIS is to use the technology and use data that we've collected to understand the shape of the land as well as the shape of the sea floor. We can then use those data to go up down to the water lab and build a physical model, which we can then use to simulate how the waves interact with the beach, what kind of a structures might be what kind of structures might be needed to maintain the, the open and per permanently as well as what kind of flows are going to be needed from the lake to be able to keep it open permanently. So it's a really nice mixture of the technology and data with a physical model that hopefully gives us some answers about how the real world is behaving and how we can best work with it.